everybody, Terry Cruz here, and this is what we are doing for today's day. This is where we all start off for the first time in the NBA season. We're about to present to you the NBA Rival Week. Now this is the first time of the season that we're about to be seeing what team goes next. This is what happens right now that we all see for anybody's game. And remember, they're always the friendly. But it's not always that long of how well they do. For this first rival matchup, we're about to see this team as the Chicago Bulls of the team as Zach Levine is not here with us anymore and they are facing against the other team of Miami Heat. Here are the starting groups of a lineup. Kobe White, Alex Caruso, DeMar DeRozan, Patrick Williams, and Nikola Vizivich. And for Miami Heat side, we have is Kyle Lowry, Tyler Hero, Jimmy Butler, everybody's favorite player, Caleb Martin, and the big man, Bam on a bio. Now here's what they all have to go with. This rivalry was the Chicago Bulls, and they began once in Miami Heat and became contenders during the 1990s. It was a decade dominated by the Bulls and Michael Jordan. Now, what in the world are they going to do? This is what the first thing is going to happen now for the NBA Rival Week. Standing by, I have is Kevin Harlan, along with Greg Anthony and Doris Burke will be on the other side with the commentators, as Brent Berry will be able to take us with here, and David Aldrich will be on the sideline for tonight's game. Let's send you down to Kaseya Center, as right now the Heat play against the Bulls. I'll see you all later for the post-game show. Halftime will be Garvin Irving Johnson, Kenny Jet Smith, and Shag O'Neal. Let the NBA Rival Games begin! Two K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA Rival Week. Welcome to Two K Sports. We have the NBA coming up. Great to have you with us. Kevin Harlan here, along with analyst Greg Anthony and Steve Smith, and we'll be hearing from DA along the sideline all game long. A look at the Bulls' starting lineup. Vucevic is the pivot. Williams is in the other post spot. Alex Caruso out there with Kobe White. And it's DeRozan in at the three, the small forward. And for Miami, backcourt guards are Lowry and Hero. The forward spots will be Butler and Martin. And it's Adebayo in at the five spot. And these are two veteran-laden teams, Steve, battle-tested, and they know what's required to get it done. Totally right, Kevin. Young teams don't usually win a lot of games. It takes time to learn the ins and outs of this league. Outside Lowry. Pass to Hero. Butler on the way. Shot from 12. Jim and C. Butler! From the paint, but you can't give him a mid range. From Tyler Hero. To the paint. He barred a rose in. Flying high. From Kobe White. Going it down with the one hand. One of his favorite moves right there, guys. On the pass to Autobahn. Lowry passes to Butler. Back to Lowry. And here is Butler. A shot. Cheers! B! Butler's got Butler! Butler! From Kyle Lowry. Grit of Jimmy Butler. Defender all over him. Contact, and it's a bucket all the same. As to Vucevic. Shoots the three. A three point. Give it all Vucevic. For three. He likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. And here's Hero. He'll bring it up for the Miami Heat. Butler finds Hero. Lowry from outside. DeRozan with the rebound. And you watch the way DeRozan gets his. He really pounds that mid-range area. The reason why GA, his strong ball handling skills, gets him into the lane. He also has the vertical to shoot over pretty much anyone. And he's DeRozan. With his back to the basket. The silky smooth jump of DeRozan. I could watch DeMar shoot all day. Passes to Lowry. Hero kicks to Mark. Hero against Caruso. Lowry from outside. Lowry! And make it a great pass. 
Caruso, the pass to White. And stolen by Kyle Lowry. Here's Hero. Tyler Hero! From Kyle Lowry. With the fast break results and a high percentage look. Not always the case these days. Chicago with the ball. Following the score by Miami. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. And Miami foul. Bam on the bio. His first personal foul. First team foul. Shooting for the Chicago Bulls. Nikola Vucevic. On a line. Two shots. Also, just how important a generational player like MJ can be. Take a break, take a break. Two shots. That one is off. GA, the three point shooting for Miami has been the story. Sometimes they run cold, like a lot of teams. Man, when they're hot, they are fun to watch. A couple years back, Kevin, they led the league in percentage from long distance. Last season, one of the worst in that category until the playoffs, where they rediscovered that shooting touch. And the second free throw, good. LGA for the Bulls, it's been a struggle to find consistency the past few seasons. It's been a one-step forward, one-step back kind of situation. That they don't need to set their sights on a title yet. They just have to establish that winning culture. Hero finds Adebayo. Great team that time for Vucevic. That was excellent contest, preventing him from making something that's usually automatic. Here's White. And it's Miami with the rebound. A pull up. And it's White with the rebound. And so White will bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. They trail by one. No good that time. Good work defensively by Mark. Well, he would have gone four seven from the field, shooting over 50%. Here's the three. And DeMar DeRozan pulls it down. For Chicago, they've gone 50% from the field, hitting three of six since the opening tip. Now, Caruso. He has yet to score. Pass to Vucevic. Shot clock at five. The Bulls need to get a shot off here. And they take the lead. We've seen his cool. confidence grow since he came into the league. Oh, he has timeout. Ball by the Heat. Three point shot now. And Miami calls their first timeout of the game. By this time of the season, I think it's fair and right to say we know the identity of these teams. How much are you worried about record at this point if you're a player? And Kevin, I wouldn't worry about record as much as I do camaraderie and, and execution. I also look at the schedule up to this point. How has the team fared against tough competition? And the Bulls will go for a different look here. This competition for the Miami Heat. Thomas Bryant. DeRozan. Josh Richardson. Is checked in for Alex yeah, Jack Pass Jr. Yes, Carter in for one. And Duncan Robinson. Oh, Butler. And he can certainly fill it up when they need him to. He's averaging almost 21 points a game. Here's Bryant. The shot. Thomas Bryant. We've seen Butler develop his passing. Jimmy Butler. Years. And there's the pass to Tate. And it's Drummond missing. Miami's gone, one of three from beyond the arc so far in the game. It's stolen by Vucevic. Pass to Dosunu. Fires the three. Yeah, it's Dosunu. from team three. Some guys just understand how to generate points. He's one of them. Pass to Hawkins. Here's the Florida. 18 that time for Vucevic. Chicago leading by three. Two minutes. Dos. Momento. One fifty-one left to play in the first quarter. A 
Hunter finds Vucevic. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Here's Dosunmu. And the three off target. And this is what you like about his perimeter game. He never gave up and challenged the deep. You see some guys, they just mail it in. They Duncan Robinson! Keep it going. At some point, you expect the defense will adjust. Now here is Carter. Nothing on the board. Poked away. Here's Bryant. And the shot. Thomas Bryant. Every time the ball comes inside. Now here's Dosumu. He has five. The pointer, and the Bulls get it back inside, and tonight he sends it right off the glass. Here's Richardson. Josh, Josh Richardson. And now a full Jimmy Butler. That's their third straight make off an assist. Here's no sooner. And there's the whistle. Three second violation. Heat ball. Substitution for the, the Bulls. Patrick Williams. And for the Heat. No shortage of That's the end of the first quarter. Miami Heat. 20. Let's take a quick break now. And the Chicago Bulls. 16. That is the end of the first period. Let's get you down with a quick break, and we'll get you on your way second for now. Okay, let's bring things on. And hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far, halfway through the first half in this one. And look at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Heat. They're unselfish. They're passing the ball well, setting up teammates, playing team basketball at their focus. And also, they're doing something you don't see as much anymore, and that is converting time and time again from the mid-range. So with Butler sitting on the bench, this is who Eric Spolster has on the floor. Backcourt guard, Joel Reed Hero. Kevin Love out there with Bam Adebayo. Obi in White. In at the small this forward is position. Alex Russo. He can make that pass in his sleep. So when we're talking about team identities, uh, Greg, what would you say is the Miami Heat's identity? Tough nosed, aggressive, and hard working. Uh, that's what attracted guys like Jimmy Butler here. Alex Russo. That's his the ball. They Kobe White. Continue playing. Go into the rack with energy in the D, afraid to cut him off. Yeah, gotta chalk that one up to some shaky defending. In a close game like this, everything has to be challenged, and everything has to be earned. Now, here's Adebayo. Still yet to score. Here's Hill. Cross contact. Alec Hero! This guy is a gamer. Foul on the Bulls. Patrick Williams is first personal foul. First team foul. has never been shy of the big moment. Out of the line where he Tyler Hero. One shot. His great off-ball movement allows him to find looks, Kevin. Hero isn't afraid of stepping up with the game on the line. Served them well. 
It's stolen by DeRozan. To the inside, Williams. Good. Patrick it's Williams. DeRozan picking up the assist. Assist from Williams is Demar DeRozan. The night. Looking at his numbers, DeRozan has added playmaking to his skill set. Impressive for a win. White against Lowry. Here's Robinson. Solid. Duncan Robinson. Robinson's got five now. Paul rushing all Brown the time. Lowry. Duncan Robinson is getting better at scoring while under pressure. And with an update from the sidelines, let's check in with David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Jimmy Butler made some headlines a while back when he said he wished the NBA would allow more of the scrapping we saw in decades past. So would I. He says that would suit his Patrick game. Williams. Jimmy said, I want to run into people and see who falls down first. Who's going to quit first? That's the style of basketball I like to play. Uh, yep, you're right. And it shows, D.A., it shows. Thank you so much. Here's Lowry after the Bulls pick up two. Pass to Autobio. Six to shoot. Fires from 14. And it's Martin missing. The defense is right there. Quality contest, and they threw him off his rhythm. Here's White, and good. Kobe White. Bounce off the right side of the rim. And the Bulls lead by one. The defense not putting up any fight on the inside. They've allowed 10 straight points in the paint. The shot by Autobio, no good. Uh, more good work on the glass there. When it's all said and done, I think rebounding might tell the story in this game. This shot can't get past Bam. This reach was just Tyler Dero. Getting in control early on. Yeah, and you look at the lead change. It's six already. And now the first time. Timeout. Chicago Bulls coming against New York in their last game play. And that was a game to forget. You'd like to find some teachable moments, but I think they like to just turn the page and move forward. Nothing wrong with that. Sometimes we overanalyze things. Can be better to just let it go. Looks like there's a lot of fight going on in between the Miami Heat and the Bulls, but this is what the challenging is. They're not trying to like let them get away with this because I was thinking right at this moment. There's going to be a lot of huge changes in between of them, but they do not want to get away with them. So we're not even sure what would happen, but you, do you have any choices what's going to happen here, Terry? Well, I'm not pretty sure. This is going to be a tough one and a challenging range. It's, it's the first one for the start of the season for the rivals, and this is what happens. A lot of team face off rival teams. Not so easy at all. But this was a tough one that everybody's been facing. Well, we'll see what happens right now. And then halftime show will be coming up later in just around the corner. Let's catch you back down to Kevin Harlan and the crew. And Miami will get a change here. Butler's checked in. New substitutions from Miami Beach. Vucevic, Jimmy Butler. Here's White. 26 points for him last game against the Knicks of New York. Great defensive effort, just saved a basket. You know what? This is why you never give up. Jim! You know Me! Going to Butler! And they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. Like the bastard throws it. And the Bulls with another miss. Wow, that's one you just kind of assume is going in. Tough luck. And the pass to Martin. Back to Lowry. Good ball movement here by Miami. And it's Butler missing. Bulls trail by three. Here's White. And a lot of guys Miami foul. One, so Number 14. Tyler Hero. His most personal foul. Second team foul. Out of line for the Bulls. Number zero. Kobe White. Out of line for two shots. These guys. Players love having someone like that on the floor with them.
And that one falls for White. New substitution. So players sometimes right after a change of venue, they, they change teams, Dawson. certainly taking the next step. And number nine. Can key that lead. Charlie Taylor. It's not all just opportunity and fit. I think there can be a mental component as well. A, a fresh start can give you a blank canvas to try new things. And so he's able to get one of two. Kobe White might be new to the league, but he doesn't play like it. Confidence and ability are beyond his years. Hero against DeRozan. Hero kicks him up. Butler's got his third. Jimmy Butler. Bulls trail by four. White the bastard Osun. Great tee that time from Hero. Unusual for him, just a lack of concentration. Fails to finish the play. Lowry against White. And the Kyle Lowry! For Miami. And Two. Was Outside white. Six on the shot clock. The put back. The put back is no good. He's doing what he can to help them cut into this lead. His shot just isn't quite there tonight. Martin finds your own. At the Martin. It's over Vucevic. Again. Martin. Tyler, hero! Bulls trail by eight. We've got 113 left to play here in the second quarter. Here's White. It's Autobio with the rebound. Autobio's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Lowry from outside. Kyle! Ayo Dawson, and despite the high start, this from Kobe White, away from shooting the trip. 50 seconds left in the first half of the game. And Butler launches from deep. Chicago grabs a miss. The Heat beat them last time when these two teams met down in South Florida. And defensively in that one, they needed to come up with big stops to quiet that crowd. And that's obviously easier said than done. Yes, Kobe White is feeding off that enthusiasm. You have to try and match that energy. And didn't do anything fancy there, but didn't need to. Nope, he, his only concern right now is getting the points on the board. And I, I don't mean style points. The shot by Adebayo, no good. Lowry against White. Over to the left wing. That's good. And Ayo Dawson good. Down to for three. Points with a bucket from Dosumu. Good heads up basketball from Kobe. Spots a wide open. Two, three, four. We're going to have to wait before heading to the locker room. Gonna bring out the monitor and see if he got that shot off in time. The play is under review yeah, for tell. a bucket count now, for Miami. Okay, so a good time to go to the replay just to make sure if he got it off on time. After official review, it is determined that the call has been overturned. No bucket. And that is the end for the first half. 38 in the Bulls. 34. Good call, fellas. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. 
Eat out front, up by four. And now let's catch up with David Aldrich, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Gooch. They had it going the first two quarters. How do you turn that around defensively? Uh, just going to get one-on-one -on -one stops. Uh, do a better job helping each other. Uh, just, you know, getting uh, whatever they want on that end. Uh, we have to do a better job. And, uh, yeah, it's just simple, you know, one-on-one -on -one stops. Mm -hmm. We help. Make sure the guy that helps, he gets up and just keep rotating. Uh, we have another dude job with that. We usually very good with that. So, we got to focus. You know, uh, and come back and take it out half ready. Then we can make it a game if we uh, uh, play better defensively. Thanks for your time, man. Appreciate it. Back to you guys. All right, Dave, thank you. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow right here on 2K Sports. It's the, the 2K, 2K Sports, Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Tremendous first half. Glad to have you back. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jetsman. It was a closely contested first quarter for Miami. And in that period, the most they trailed by was three. Scoring-wise, they broke even in the second, so little ground was lost there. Kenny, let's start with you. What do you think about the Heat? Well, I like what I'm seeing on the offensive end. They're keeping things simple, getting to their spot. Double wins, kind of like Shaq Sue. How about you, Shaq? What did you think about Chicago? Hard to feel happy when your opponent shooting over 6%. You don't have to make things harder for those guys defensively. Force them out their cover zone. Contest every shot. And that'll do it for our halftime report. Stay tuned for the second half. About to get underway. You've been watching the 2K Sports Halftime Show. And if you're just joining us, we played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. And here's White. He'll bring it up for Chicago. Four-point game. Following this one, they get to host the Hornets. That game is the first and last. Miami foul, foul. number seven, for Kyle Lowry. Right it's first personal foul, first team foul. And a line for the Bulls, Kobe White. And a line for two shots. The Bulls have made two and missed two at the line tonight. one falls. Well, Smitty, this summer, you down his hands from retiring after 20 years in the NBA, and all with the Miami Heat. Kevin, he is Mr. Miami, born and raised, and his impact on the city and the organization goes well beyond the court. He is Heat coaching. And both free throws, good for White. The Heat with the lead. Hero passes to Adebayo. But Tyler, keeping his eyes up and his options open, delivers a great pass. Now here's White. And it's out of bounds. The heat out of bounds. The other way. Heat ball. He had some numbers for Martin. He's been a factor for them over the last month. He's putting up about 12 points a game, seven rebounds, and two assists. And most of all, you have to love the defensive grit he brings to games when he comes off the bench. Absolutely. Just when you think you've got a good flow going as a score, he'll come and shut your water off. Now, here's Butler. Back to Hero. He kicks to Butler. Shot clock at six. Shoots over Caruso. Jimmy right Butler. And now a six-point heat lead. Chicago's gone four six from outside the arc tonight. To Rosen against Butler. Miami Fouls. Number 13. Bam on a bio. Is he first personal foul? Catches the defensive lead. Two shots. 
numbers on the season when you look at their free throw attempts right around 78%. Jack of all trades, player for, to our for Chicago Bulls, number five, Javon Carter. The Bulls making a switch here. Carter's checked in. Tamar and DeRozan hits them both. Here in and here out, Smitty, the Heat bring energy and commitment to the defensive end. Kevin, the Miami Heat has a strong culture, and they've done a good job bringing in players that match their identity. It's led to a great deal of Jim B. Straight to begin this hand. Kyle Lowry. Draw it up any better. Carter against Butler. Carter is your two to Rosen. Over Lowry. That is good. The Heat's DeMar DeRozan. Down to four again on the bucket from DeMar DeRozan. That's all muscle memory for DeRozan. He's the king of the mid range. Butler finds Martin. Now Lowry. There is Hero with the three. It's all in by the Bulls. Vucevic has got his fourth rebound in this one. Even though that one didn't go down, I like the offensive game plan here. Three for four coming out of the break. Pass to Kirk. The dish to DeRozan. From the high post. And it's Miami with the rebound. Adebayo has got his sixth rebound on the night. And a wide open look for Tar Hero. Hero. Three. Here in the third. Only John Colin Martin. Williams inside, covered by Martin. Out to Carter. Good. Javon Carter. For three. Carter's got himself on the board with three there. Timeout. We talk Miami about Heat. Williams' physical abilities, but right there, you see the awareness and willingness to be unselfish. Timeout call the Heat. The NBA Rival Week on 2K Sports is brought to you by. Ruffles, the official chip of the NBA. Sour Patch Kids. And by Starry Lines. New substitution for the Miami Heat. Number 11, Jalen Tuckes Jr. And number 52, Duncan Robinson. A force to be reckoned with offensively. And yet, he's a true professional at the free throw line. It's a part of the game where he excels. You want him at the line for you in crunch time. Jalen Tuckes Jr. Oh, uh, okay, Robinson. Basket with that setup. Caruso gets to DeRozan, tries it for 19. Javier's with the rebound. Miami leading by six. Bryant the pass to Javier's. Puts up a three. And Kyle! And they get it. Caruso, no good. 
Vahid have gotten nearly everything to drop this point. They're seven of eight from the floor since halftime. Robinson kicks the lock. Good ball movement here by Miami. Five to shoot. And he makes Kyle it. Kyle Lowry! And Jock Dash Jr. Foul of Chicago. Come on, Carter. It's first first goal. Second team foul. It's all about the mid range game. It has been a At the line to read. Kyle Lowry. And it's been one painful. shot. And you can't ignore their passing. All game long, they've done a great job of just delivering the ball in rhythm right where it needs to be. Free throw drops for Lowry. You love the intensity Kyle Lowry brings. He gives you a no nonsense mentality at the point guard position. Timeout, Chicago Bulls. And the lack of rim protection, top of the list. And it boils down to the question toughness. One team showing it, the other allowing itself to be bullied. Well, there is a lot of end in his stats right now. The heat's on fire. We'll get you a quick break here. We will come back. Let's go, Tom. Make this happen. The rival takedowns. And we are back right now. Let's send you back to Kevin Harlan and the crew. Back to you. And checking out some numbers for Ben Adebayo. And guys, I think he's starting to feel the wear and tear of the season a little bit. That, that comes across in his rebounding numbers. They dropped off this month. He needs that second win and no doubt he'll get it soon. Now here's Drummond. Still scoreless. The Andre Drummond. Well done. Assisted by as good as Drummond is, Corner. He still has much more room to grow, especially as they score. Butler feeling out of it. That's the lot of Fires for three. Kyle! From Jimmy Butler. Time and time again. Yeah, the defense has allowed him to get into a rhythm from there. And he's been relentless. Two minutes. Most momento. The pass to Hawkins. No step. Hawkins Jr. Chicago foul on Andre Drummond. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for Heat, Jalen Duckers Jr. At the line, one shot. New substitution for the Miami Heat. Number 42, Kevin Loves. And number zero, Josh Richardson. Bulls trail by 18. Pass to Dosunu. Outside, White. That one goes in. Kobe White. White. Got four points now in the quarter. Kobe White glides around the court with the ball on the string, ready to shoot. And no hesitation. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thank you, Kevin. Now, heat culture seems to be a cliche, but it's not. Jimmy Butler says we never lost confidence in this group, in ourselves. Jane Duckers Jr. We're not worried about anybody else, just the guys in our room. Um, Josh Richardson. Staff, leadership, management. Back to you guys. Boy, David, aren't they locked in? There's something else. Thank you. And here are the Bulls now, after the Heat pick up two. Dosunu shot his hook. And the pressure he put on that shot forced the miscue. The rim protection. And his Kevin Love! Or 
Dawson. Yeah, Duck Hats, Junior. Overall, they're the team getting the better looks here in this second half. For them, the first half was maybe more of a filling out process. Nikola Yusevich. One of the cases where hype fails to tell you the whole story. Well, he leading by 18. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Outside Robinson. Here's Hockey. Vucevic with the rebound. Vucevic has got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Here's White. White. And it's Kobe White. White. By White. White's got 13. This is who White is, a competitor, a hard-nosed player. Love the activity on the office glass. And here's Rob with the game. It is Kevin Three! shot puts three more onto their lead. That's the end of it for a quarter. Miami Heat, 60 watts. He's been a major and from Chicago Bulls, 50 watts. Back to the action in just a minute. And 70 for Heat. Sorry about that. Be right back after this. Now let's hear what head coach Billy Donovan was reviewing with his team in the home. not too happy failing to get back on defense a major sin in the game of basketball especially from his standpoint yeah and anytime you get severely out hustled you're going to hear about it from your coach and you should if he's worth anything and we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may be already out of hand Adebayo is the big man with Butler sliding in at the four Hero out there with Josh Richardson and it's Robinson in at the three. That's the group in the game for the Heat. DeMar DeRozan. Good. They're scoring boatloads of buckets. It's raining buckets from inside. This is a two on the He can't get that one to fall. 18 that time for Vucevic. Trying to finish out the game strong. You have to recognize who has the hot hand and get in the ball. Carter against Richardson. Carter, the best to DeRozan. Over Adebayo. And the ball DeMar DeRozan. Ever since his days at USC, DeRozan has been a natural on offense. Hero kicks him up. He dishes it to Richardson. Over Carter. And there's Josh Richardson. Richardson. Butler's got Jimmy Butler assist in this one. Robinson against DeRozan. A little over a minute and a half of the fourth quarter gone now. DeMar DeRozan. Two points. Man, he keeps doing his part. They just haven't been able to get over the hump. Outside Robinson. It's Richardson on the way. Down low. Josh Richardson to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement has been flawless. Now here's Williams. Puts it up from 15, and the Bulls tag on two more. Patrick Williams. And they're leading on the mid range right now. That's six of the last ten from that area. Fourth quarter, playing for about two and a half minutes through it right now. Pass to Robinson. Butler against Williams. And it's Butler missing. Great defensive effort just saved a basket. You know what? This is why you never give up on a play. You don't know what's going to happen. Miami leading by 15 to the middle. Here's on the line. Duncan Robinson. And so it's Carter who brings the ball up for the Bulls. The pass to Vucevic. Pass to Dosunu. Yes, Ayo Dawson. It was a bucket. Number five on a five for 11 night. Good instincts from Nicola. Finding the open man. 
and kicks it outside. Outside, Hero. Butler against Williams. And Jimmy, here go. Me, love it. Butler. Well, used to pick a high percentage shot for Jimmy Butler off pick and roll plays. Here's Joe Sinu. Passes it to DeRozan. It's hauled in by the Heat. They led the game at one point by 20. Butler goes in. Jim! Butler! Player. Butler is very hard to stop. Run Duncan Robinson. In game with passion. Bulls trail by 19. Time out call. Time out, Chicago. One more big change. And then after that one, we'll be pronouncing your new balance player of the game. For this one, Miami Key has been a best part of a team. They have been clutching it inside to go for another playoff round, and they wanted to do this one again. What do you think there, Terry Cruz? Well, I'm pretty sure. I'm looking at over this one, and there probably might be another change off at that point. Looks like you're done really well, keeping the offense alive again and again. I've never seen how well they're good, but this time, it turned out to be radically different than anybody here before. But I never know what's going to happen like that. We might see how well they do. They might try to like keep on attacking. They probably might be just keeping it going. You'll never know when it comes like that. Well, in that case, we'll have to find out what happens if Miami Heat takes a win over the Bulls to try to push them out. Now, let's present your New Balance player of the game. As right now, Kevin stands by. Who do you have? And let's take a look at the New Balance player of the game. Lowry. And in terms of his shooting, this has been one of the more accurate performances you'll ever see. I mean, he's been in constant motion, creating a lot of good looks for himself. But, but still, even when you're wide open, you expect to miss some of the time. That has not been the case here tonight. This guy has made everything. The lift he got from this home crowd has been obvious. There's nothing fans love more than getting a big game out of someone other than one of their stars. Now here's White, pass to Caruso. Front pass the arc, White. Kobe White. White's got We're three nine points here in the second half. We've seen White fill it up before. Once he gets cooking, good luck trying to contain him. Outside Robinson. The pass to Martin. Inside, Lowry. And it's sent back by White. to the inside, and it's Vucevic visiting, and he leading by 16. Two minutes, dose, momento, for Kyle Lowry. Well, credit them for being Kyle Lowry. Being up this much. They don't want to From be on his way up. Before he come back, just focus on playing the right way. Outside, White. Outside Williams, pocket six, and it's off from three-point range. Miami's gotten off 12 shots from beyond the arc tonight, hitting seven of them. They get it back. Martin kicks to out of bio. The kick outside to Butler, and the officials call for three seconds. Second violation. Chicago ball. Here's a position for Chicago. 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 On the as well as the and Miami team. You really got to give it up here Jamal. for Miami. Starting five must have been happy to get so much help from the reserves in this game. And they not only lightened the load, the subs did nothing less than guarantee a win. And I think a great job in positioning themselves for the W here. It's win number 21 on the season. And one of the key components to this victory, if not the biggest, was the incredible performance for Kyle Lowry. You love to see this kind of leadership, directing traffic, keeping everyone. Andre Drummond. He was the straw that stirred the drink. 
That's why you never quit battling on the offensive glass. And that's a nice reward for his effort. Uh, the flush, perfect. Working hard, beating everyone to the ball. He does this night in and night out. Now, here is Robinson, and stolen by Drummond. Carter with it. Lowry picks him up. Carter with it. Pass to Caruso. Andre Drummond, assist drive. On the heels of this you wonder where was this effort earlier on? Well, the question becomes, are they playing that much better now, or has their opponent taken the rest of the night off? Back to Robinson. Kicks it to Martin. Shot from the top of the key. Good in the Killer Martin! Martin. Impressive job by the players, coaches, and don't discount the impact of these fans. They gave the team tremendous energy tonight. The fans were fantastic. It was a true open. And that's the game! Your final score, Miami Heat, 84. Chicago Bulls, 68. I mean, the energy here is just so tremendous. Fans involved from the get-go. And once they started to really pour it on, it was fun to see that rhythm and flow from their perspective. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, man. Congrats on the win. This arena was rocking tonight. What difference does it make when they're loud like this? Man, this place gets rocking, man. I love to play in front of my meat friends, man. That's a wonderful rub. And uh, they stay behind us 24-7 no matter what, and we can't thank them enough for that. And hey, you fed off of them tonight, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you guys. Much appreciated, David. And that about wraps it up. For David Aldridge, Craig Anthony, and Steve Smith, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. All right. Thank you, Kevin Harlan. And I expected that this game is turning out the best. That was the first rival matchup as we're taking a look at the team comparisons here. For the start of a run, we have is the field goal percentage and three pointers. 66% and 58% of the pointer was turning out to be Miami Heat. Then it was only 75% that turned to be a free throw to take. This is only for the bowls. Fast break and points in the paint has only turned out once. 17 and 38 for Miami Heat. Second chance points was Chicago Bulls. Bench points was 29 and 33 assists for Miami Heat. Offense rebounds was number 7 for Chicago. 21 for Miami Heat of the defensive rebounds. Then four steal, two blocks were even. Six and points off was nine for turnovers. That turned to be a little much more than that. Only three team fouls called on Chicago Bulls and seven dunks were performed. 20 was the biggest lead and 14.45 was their time of possession for the Bulls. Did as much to say right now? It has been a close one to keep an eyes on net in the first quarter and the second quarter was a breakaway apart to go with it all. Now it's time to start with your three star players of the game. Beast, you take yours. All right, thank you so much, Terry. As right now, we start off with number three. This one was gonna turn, bring things all over again that we couldn't really tell which one did it. It was all that did happen now, and it was DeMar DeRozan with 14 points, three rebounds, one assist, and a steal. Only happened to be 6 out of 11 field goal range with only 16 performance run and only a dunk was performed here on the court. Not bad at all, but this one turned out like he might do it again for the next game to play against the Bucks. It might be a tough team, but you may never know what you get to go that far and get from here. The second star player goes to Kobe White, the veteran from North Carolina, 16 points, 3 rebounds, Four assists and a block has made on Kyle Lowry. That was all that does happen now with two dunks, 25 performance run, and only 6 out of 14 field goal range was turned out to be just that. And your first star player of the game goes to Kyle Lowry. 19 points, two rebounds, six assists, nice work with two steals, 31 performance run, 7 out of 9 field goal of percentage, and 4 three-pointers were made. It's just definitely the remarkable run to keep that one scoring in. And what a play for the Heat. 
Back to you, Terry. Son of Beast out. Thank you so much. And I really appreciate that everyone who has been here with the part of the game. Unfortunately, we'll have to see what Wood Spoonie has to cover it up for the next rival game. So thank you all for tuning in for the first NBA Rival Week on 2K Sports. We'll see you back in time on the other side of the NHL Rival Week on EA Sports. Terry Cruz is out, and don't forget to subscribe to his channel. You can also follow him on his social media. The links are in the About page. And until next time, for an NBA Rival Week on 2K Sports. And I'll see you all again next time. Have a great night, everybody. And be sure to subscribe to his channel. If you don't, somebody will. Until next time. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.